Hi, my name is Meta Hazenberg. I'm a clinical hematologist and PI at the Amsterdam uh, University Medical Center in Amsterdam, the Netherlands. And uh, the question uh, that I've been asked to answer is what is the evidence that fecal microbiota transplantation can cure graft versus host disease? Well, the short answer is, I guess, that there, the, the definite proof isn't there yet. Um, we do have some uh, preliminary data that suggests that indeed FMT uh, can cure graft versus host disease, uh, steroid refractory graft versus host disease. Um, there are a number of cases and case series uh, describing uh, positive responses to one or multiple FMTs. And we ourselves um, have done a prospective pilot uh, clinical trial um, describing 15 patients with steroid refractory and steroid dependent graft versus host disease. Um, and uh, out of these 15 patients, uh, 10 people responded. Uh, graft versus host disease was uh, completely resolved in these patients. Um, but then when we tried to taper immunosuppressants like steroids and others, uh, in uh, four of the 10 responding patients, uh, graft versus host disease uh, uh, yeah, reoccurred. So um, in six out of the 10 responders, the response was lasting. And that was to only one FMT in a heavily pretreated group. So I think these data are uh, su suggesting that indeed FMT could be helpful and could be a cure, but you know it needs to be confirmed in a prospective uh, preferably a randomized control trial. Um, trials like that are going on, so um, I'm very hopeful that uh, that those data will be out at some point. Um, at ASH, there's also uh, a presentation by the Malar group um, presenting their uh, first data on their um, clinical trial on the FMT, so I think that's interesting to watch. Um, and um, yeah, so we are eagerly waiting those uh, follow-up data to, and in the hope that we can indeed uh, really answer these questions.